Welcome back to Getting Started with Game Creator. Now that we've seen how to create a fully fledged character, it's time to learn how to frame it. Games use a wide variety of cameras. Some place them on the player's shoulders to increase immersion. Others follow the action from a top-down perspective and give a wide tactical view of the map. And others place cameras on corners, hiding from the player the next jump scare. All these setups can be very easily created using Game Creator. But before getting into details, let's see how the camera system works. There are two components that handle all the logic behind the camera system. The main camera and the camera shots. The main camera component is a dummy object that does nothing but copy the behavior of the active camera shot. On the other hand, camera shots are components that, when active, tell the main camera what to do. There can be multiple camera shots in the scene, but only one active at a time. Transitioning between different shots is very easy and can be done using the game creator's visual scripting. There are many types of camera shots and we'll overview some of the most commonly used. The fixed position behaves like a surveillance camera. It doesn't move from its place but can rotate around itself to track a target. The follow target camera shot copies the position of a target, tracking it from a certain distance. This is an excellent choice for top-down adventure games. The third person camera shot, as its name implies, helps create cameras where the user can orbit them around a target and zoom in and out. First person. This camera shot views the action from the player's perspective. It comes with many options to tweak in order to immerse the user into the world, such as head bobbing, leaning towards the character's acceleration, and procedural organic noise. Let's put together all we've seen so far. To create a camera shot, right click on the hierarchy panel and select Game Creator, Cameras, Shot Camera. This will create a shot object on the scene and assign it to the main camera if none was present before. To change the type of camera shot, select the object from the scene and click its title to reveal a drop down menu with all the available options. Now that we know how to create characters and use cameras, we'll learn how these can interact with each other and with other elements using Game Creator's intuitive visual scripting. See you in the next episode!